spectacle showing off the skills of San Francisco's most talented skaters ended horribly for one young woman. KPI XY's Andrea Borba live at Mission Dolores Park with details on what happened. Andrea? Well, Alan, I'm sitting at the base of the hill that is so tempting for so many skateboarders, and it's one of those things that they just have to do. Unfortunately, for one San Francisco skateboarder, it has landed her into the critical care unit at San Francisco General Hospital. For many skateboarders, the siren song of San Francisco's towering hills cannot be ignored. Last Thursday, on the edge of Mission Dolores Park, Dolores Street was the site of a popular hill bombing. Where skateboarders on their decks, four tiny wheels and trucks take on the grades, gravity and G-forces that make San Francisco world famous. Among those skateboarders, 21-year-old Tomoka Okiawa. On her last ride of the night, she took a nasty spill on the unforgiving asphalt. Uh, she might have been clipped by someone or maybe her trucks got loose and uh, she unfortunately took a really hard fall and fractured her skull, the back of her skull, which is the strongest bone in your body, and uh, sustained uh, several injuries to her brain, a lot of swelling. Tomo, as she's known, had emergency surgery Friday to relieve swelling in her brain. While she's still in a dangerous window, she is awake and responding to touch and light. She's conscious, however, she's not able to speak or anything like that. Um, she just rests. Tomo started skating when she was still in elementary school and has shared her passion, starting a company making custom skateboard grips and building ramps and teaching kids in her mom's hometown in the Philippines to skate. Tomo's sister rides a motorcycle and says thrill seeking is in the family DNA. You know, it's a risk that we take every day for, for our love. Um, but I do hope, and I'm not trying to use Tomoko's platform as a way to educate, but I do hope skaters out there are a little bit safer. You know, it's, uh, just one little slip up can change your entire life. Now, the skateboarding community has started a GoFundMe page to help pay for some of Tomo's care. She will be in the hospital for months on end and then rehabilitation centers after that. They are trying to help her out tonight. Live at Mission Dolores Park, Andrea Borba, KPIX 5.